And let me slide this over to here. And hey, welcome back to another wonderful... This will be a slightly longer uh, SMT5 night. Get this all set up properly. But yeah, um, hopefully y'all enjoyed the... Um, the Janoon demo. Really comfy. Um, I have a feeling it's really going to be one of those games that is actually open world and there will be a lot of side quests. But I am definitely okay with that. Also, in case you missed the news, SMT5 5 coming to not a Nintendo Switch near you. So, fingers crossed. I would love to see this on something that could even handle a consistent 30 FPS. All right. Oh, I remember what we were trying to do here. Oh, uh, yeah, this is, um, what's her heck? Is the right direction? Okay, it's lightning and then wind. Oops. myself notes this Okay, uh, she's weak. Ice fire. <laughs> lightning wind so I forgot I grabbed Hydra. He might not be a bad call here. This Eden is definitely going to be smoking the crack pack on that one. Uh, Lamu should be okay because ice. Let me... Let me see if I have anything for that that I can kind of slide myself into here.
Welcome. I don't think there's anything that straight blocks both that I have access to. I would take block one. Yeah, that's risky. I think it's going to be your longer here. Let's, let's go with this, just to make our lives easier. <laughs> and then I could probably swap it back to Atavka. That one, that one wouldn't be awful. All right, yeah, let's, let's try this. Cause I got, I got, uh, I got like to the bare knuckle end of the fight last time and then just mixed up my signals. <laughs> I just have to remember I'm now uh, fire vulnerable. Hit this at full moon. And absolutely light her up. Apparently, she was one of the last, uh, one of, if not the last demons designed by one of, like, the original design crew before they left. So it's really neat to see that she plays a pretty important role in the game. I think that's pretty nice. What's not nice is this frame rate. God, I can't wait to play something like this on PC. Also, it's 2023. Sorry, 2024. Can we please stop using motion blur to cover shitty frame rates? Please. Also, can we just not have motion blur, period? It looks ugly. It's like when you crank up chromatic aberration way higher than it should be. Be careful. Amanozako's on the verge of going berserk. Take her down. I know one of the other issues we were having was like just absolutely horrible, horrible luck with with attacks landing. She have holy counter on. Spritz. Okay, heavenly counter still there. Plus attack down. Got it. Let's go. All right, 
now we can stack Fire Breath. Nice. Damage isn't great, just basically mitigating her turn count. <laughs> that was rude. Yeah, that's the, um, nice miss. Ooh, that means she doesn't get to, uh, rip on Magatsui. Yeah, that's the, um, the, the little companion we had for a while in, like, the early game. You know what? In the end, that's going to be worth it. Hydra's going to be doing some pretty hard carry here. I'm going to roll with... It's probably wind first. We're basically just going to have to guess. Hope it's wind first. Um, yeah, so a lot of times what, uh, it, like a large premise of the SMT games um, involves uh, phases of the moon and you'll get a lot of different enemy behavior and like fusion behavior and stuff in terms of like how they correlate with different phases of the moon. single miss yet. Okay, let's go with... <coughs> you know what? Let's go electric null, and if it's wind, it doesn't matter. I'll at least survive. Okay. Good crush. You know what? Let's, let's push back. Yeah, pretty much. I would love to be able to do, do something physical here. Unfortunately, it's just... She hits it with a comeback. You know, I'd love to see more than two for two to four. We can survive one more turn, I'm not worried. so close. Even if she goes into charge, it'll be whatever. Alright, it's ours to win. There it is.
Update. We are Unlimited power. The Monazako's power. We can oh, nice. use it as an essence. That's cool, I guess. this where where am i what happened to me oh i remember i couldn't control my power and started losing it right totally and you you swooped in and saved me didn't you seriously you did didn't you oh 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 and then you took my power Looks like you got a little something out of it, at least. <laughs> Good thing. <sighs> I'm so tired. <laughs> well, I guess I'll see you around. Bye-bye! Are you for real right now? Oh, okay, cool. She's just gonna leave. You know what? You know what? Fair enough. Fair deal. Let's definitely swap this affinity off. Well, <coughs> hmm. that's an interesting stat set. So I know story-wise, <laughs> we're probably going to be fighting one of the agents of Bethel soon. So my guess would be like Foley. Holy block as opposed to reflect. this charm weak steel though not terrible you know what let's go with those
physical mastery is the tough one. Hmm. I think we're okay with with how we are here. Definitely want to update are the compendium you? now. Yeah, this dude will end up being worth it. Return. Still quite a bit off. over there see if I can figure out what this one is <laughs> I hope you've been enjoying Nightingale though you know I forgot to restock I wasn't gonna help either um, I did make it through the tutorial for like the fourth time wow that is a lot of those Anyway, <laughs> yeah, a little bit of clonk. <clears throat> I uh, definitely appreciate the fact that they've been like very highly proactive about like immediately trying to patch things that they can. Exactly. We we all know how it be. This is going to be an interesting play. Here. Let me guess. Opposite of fire. Oh, wow. That physical hits. Small glory crystals, nice. Take those.
I don't know what I gave them all by accident. Oh, well. Who cares? Ah, uh, hey, bud. Oh, great. Definitely wasn't ready for this. Uh, yeah, for sure. I, I think either that'll improve as you level up or it'll just take good, you know, good management. Watch his storage crates. Walk away, you made it. Oh wow. Alright, we're we're hitting this dude pretty nicely. Accuracy evasion down stacks here pretty nicely. No. I'll probably up our evasion. That's fucking hilarious. Is this real? Oh. That's absolutely wild. I'm like, don't get me wrong, I've had my fair share of like fucking questionable ass cars, but none that bad. I also didn't pay like 70 grand for it either. You know, Quaz, it's going. We're knocking out a whole heckin' bunch of mini bosses here. Nice. <sighs> Just trucking through, grinding up some experience, some monies. Samurai Karm out of nowhere? Dude. Oh, nice. 
Nice. Uh, where can I turn that one in? I think I know how to get there. Definitely going to take a second to save and actually buy, sell some stuff here, too. No. I just want you to know, Trad, I would try and not laugh super hard while pry barring the door of your cyber truck open. I would, however, tell you that it's probably uh, not a good thing that your shit's all rusty. Also, I'm really going to question how you're get going to get warranty work done when the owner of the company is in f is, you know, on fucking Mars. <laughs> I know. It's never before have I ever had such a strong urge to just say, you know, we live in a society No, we're not going back to fucking wooden cars. Honda with anything but early 90s Honda paint. Let's go. Yo, what up, Cubs? Howdy do, brother. How is your Sterimity Stram? Listen, the Toyota Camry and Corolla are literally indestructible as long as you perform the correct maintenance. Doing some four tonight? How did it treat you? Hopefully well. Hopefully better than 15 treated me. My butt still hurts. It's all right. I did speed runs poorly as well. Uh, we did get to check out the next portion of the Rebirth demo. That was pretty darn toot and fun. Oh, uh, yeah. Okay, okay. I remember where this quest is. This is, like, really goofy. <laughs> Oof. Yeah, testing the limits of... Uh, the limits of endurance with that one. Thanks for the large chunk of money, I guess. I I I wanted to summon her. She's a lot cuter than Belphegor. 
Belphegor is literally a toilet demon. What do we want that for? Oh my god. <laughs> Welcome to my luck is really bad tonight. You know what? Correction, my luck's great. It's absolutely tremendous. This'll do. Ice, perfect. I know one of them is likely to not. Yep, I got unlucky. All right, roll the dice. Let's say it's wind. It's not wind. All right, so they're all gonna escape. Oh well, sometimes you get lucky, sometimes you don't. But yeah, if y'all don't know me, I'm Kios. It's a pleasure to meet you. Uh, I speedrun Final Fantasy 15 a lot. Um, and I play a crap ton of RPGs and occasionally DJ and sometimes cook. I clean. Twitch's fastest male wife, femboy, catboy VTuber that's really not a VTuber. Welcome. <laughs> I think I've pretty much fished most of the side quests out that aren't like incredibly stupid or useless. I'll check I'll check that one down there. And then uh, I guess we'll poke around the main story. Oh. I was actually excited. There were there, there were quite a few um like rando races and co-op playthroughs submitted for uh, questing for glory this year. Like I was genuinely like very pumped up by that. She wants horse's head. I mean, is that even in this zone? Oh, it might be that dude up there. Take a look at Bel. I don't think Belphegor ends up being that good because fire and holy like absolutely useless in this portion of the game. Yeah, it doesn't even count as a special summon. Henceforth, trash. Are you? All right. Pop a save over this. We'll take a look if we can find Horus, and then I guess we'll have to push. Forward. Yeah, 54. Pretty decent level wise. Yeah, I'd say check there. Yeah, okay. Slime, I don't mind. It's just the basilisks that are really annoying. Leave me alone, Satanta. Thank <laughs> you. 
Whoa. Yeah, well, at least I didn't fall asleep on that one. I don't think that's Horus. Well, let's give him a poke. See what we're looking at. It's just Fatal and Zianga, Weak Wind, Black Holy. You should be able to stack on this dude pretty easily. Definitely not the best, definitely not the worst. Okay, resist pretty much every status ailment. You know what? Hit with poison anyway. Beautiful. Stack two. Charge in the physical. Absolutely starting to truck on these fools. Let's go. Push it over the edge, please. Yes! Just enough. Well, it's definitely not Horus. I think I know actually where Horus is. It's on the back half. Dot. That was actually really not like anything special from Champ. Let me take a look. Yep, I bet Horus is that one up there, I'm pretty sure. All right. That dude wasn't anything fancy. I don't even think that covered my recovery costs. Lord. To be fair, though, this is like two areas behind, so... Well, that's Cinder. Enjoy Mario Kart. I think it should be this one. Yeah, that's probably the closest. There's our boy Mothman. Ooh. 
No, that's Giramakala. Meh. Dark resists physical. Got it. Keep stacking. I'm just gonna get swapped for Alice here. I have a really stupid plan. absorbs and has shock. Yeah, let's swap it. Bring back the girl. Pray that it's dark and not physical. Ah, uh, well, that's unfortunate. Holy shit! You're still alive? Wow. There's someone I haven't seen in a hot minute. Yo, what's up, Scav? Welcome in, friends. Orion, what are you doing back? <laughs> Listen, I haunt my own stream pretty well. Oh, someone was, uh, who was, uh, Poot was just talking about that, that game. How was it? Did you enjoy it? I know, it's really cool looking. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> I'm like, I don't know what it is. I'm not great at platformers, but like, I, I want to be. Man, I hope you've been taking care of yourself, homie. Uh, you know, fuck it. Let's do this. Man, yeah, hi. If you don't know me, I'm Kios. I like. I like to play the video game fast. Uh, sometimes I, I, I don't get to play video games fast, but that's okay. Let's go. Um, yeah, it's it's it, it would be nice to see you back around again. I mean, I would be like, oh, you've missed so much, and there's so much to catch you up on, but like, it's not. The VTuber community just as a whole fucking eating itself any chance that it gets. But uh, hey, I made it into GDQ finally. That was pretty cool. Yeah, well, thanks, Gina. Block miss absorb. Yeah, I was. I uh, I ran 15 in person, and they didn't physically escort me off the premises either. excited because RPG Limit Break is coming up as well, and there's a lot of cool stuff submitted. Um, there's also... Yeah, it would have been close. would have been close. I ended up getting it anyway, though, so like, you know, all's well that kind of ends well, I guess. But yeah, I, uh, I'm Kios. Hi, I do speedruns. I cook. I clean. Uh, I 3D print stuff. Hopefully y'all had a good time with Orion. Yeah, it's uh, definitely good to, to see some like not weird people <laughs> coming back. You know, people that are like mildly normal in like the non-offensive term, but like, you know what I mean. Yeah, um, I know it's it's still gonna be in the same same place in Utah. Um, I'm just not sure about what's going to happen after uh, this year, just because of some of like the legislation that's been passed recently in Utah. Um, unfortunately, I, I know that like I I can't attend in person. It's just after GDQ and a very very bad fucking tax filing um it's, it's just not in the cards for us um the other thing is if they submitted 15 I, I don't think the computers they have on site would be able to handle it um and i i'm not flying with a fucking computer especially my computer those those of you who made it to gdq and like came for taco night you know how incredibly like large and cumbersome this fucking thing is <laughs> but yeah if you can if you can go to limit break i would highly recommend it it's very very comfortable uh hi how goes the gaming pretty well uh just doing a good bit of like side boss and side quest cleanup um, before we dive into the next kind of main story arc, um, I also cleared the Janoon demo for uh, 7R. That was really fun. Um, and, you know, 15 was garbage. Nothing, <laughs> nothing in the cards to burn it on. Mm -hmm. Have you considered... I don't know. Skebs. <laughs> Froob, I swear to God, if you start typing and you're not in bed, I'm gonna 
fly to the fucking UK and beat your ass. <laughs> yeah, no, like, that's, like, the one thing that I, I think, like, I, I know people in this day and age are ins obsessed with, you know, referring to things as, like, vibes. But, like, Limit Break is very just... It's, it's just comfortable. Like, it is one of the lowest stress, no stress environments. <laughs> All right. Other fun things you could spend your bonus on. Have you considered uh, setting up a home network? Your own server, perhaps? Have you considered funding your favorite local speedrunning cap? <laughs> Have you thought about uh, buying real estate in an imaginary place? Yeah, yeah, you could definitely do that. Um, you you could look at the the Erd Tree uh, DLC collector's edition with that really cool statue. Give good advice. Uh, today was the only time I would ever fucking recommending would would have ever recommended buying zero. Uh, zero TDE NVIDIA calls. If done correctly, you could have turned $150,000 into $3 million. About 20 minutes worth of work. Yeah, I actually, I am actually rocking a way better printer now, too. Like, I could crank them the fuck out. Yeah, just get me, like, case schematics and I'll just fucking print it. I really want to know where I was supposed to turn the gear of Makala head in. Uh, I was graduating high school. At 18, I was working at U-Haul with my dad. Yeah, no, by all means. Like, if it's one of those things where you just want me to, like, fucking build it here, I can just do that, too. I've been, um, procrastinating building a yam pad for, uh, one of the community members, but it's just been, like, every time I think about it, like, I just run out of, like, the mental energy to, like, bust out the soldering iron. Because it's going to be my first time, like, actually building a, like, something from like more than just the PCB like I have to do capacitors and like LEDs and stuff so I really like want to be in the zone and focused on it because those are really fucking tiny parts and as often as I do it uh, surprisingly enough I don't like fucking burning my fingers with hot solder <laughs> oh I, generational wealth is not something that I have I have a Pretty useless college degree and thirty-eight thousand dollars in student loan debt, though. And I can probably cook some of the best food you've ever had in your life. You're surrounded by kids. Fuck you. Surround this pants grab. But yeah, by all means, I I don't mind building and 3D printing stuff. Um, that's, I should probably pull some of the time lapses off of the uh, 3D print. But yeah, in the past year or two, 3D printing's gotten absurdly easy and fast. Oh. Huh. 
Oh yeah, it's come a really long way. All right, I have a fucking Yuri Mikala head, which I know somebody fucking wants it. Ah, uh, I think that's the one. I love this game. Yeah, if y'all don't know Orion, uh, they were definitely like one of the other like first tubers that I met that was like familiar with speed running. It was like them and Cinna. Oh, shit, Vesoma? I'll definitely take that. All right, high spirits. Um... So I know the schedule isn't dropping until like March, but like, come on. <laughs> yeah, I um, I have a few projects that I definitely want to look at once we get out of like, uh, once we get out of like limit break season. Come on, you can tell us. Yeah, I mean that's what we do with. Questing for glory. <laughs> Fucking Palmer shows up an hour late. Swoog doesn't understand time zones. Magus complains about something. It's a good time. That's only 200 submissions. Come on. I care. I care a lot. Listen, even 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 if it's not like the charity version, like I I love like looking into runs that people have submitted, especially for questing for glory, because like you get a lot of those like I haven't quite figured out what I want to do with this or how I want to present this, and like I love it like that. Uh, what's the, what's the total run time for that at 200? There are a couple of runs that are like nine, 10 hours. Like, I don't know about that. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, four HP. Oh, GDQ, uh, Limit Break does run for basically a week. Um, it's just like in terms of total time submitted. Yeah, it's pr probably about what? I would say 200. There's 200 plus submissions, excluding races and co-op submissions. I'd say probably like, what, 900 hours, maybe a thousand. Why did you convert it to fucking minutes? 830, 873 and a half. Plus minus. <laughs> wow. It's okay. I pulled up my handy dandy calculator.
That's that's not bad. I mean, obviously, I wish we could make it out there. It's just, and not in the fucking cards, not this year. My guy, you don't even want to know how much it costs to to rent out a hotel for that long. Me too. I'm really excited to play it at a frame rate above 15. But yeah, it's good to see you back. Shoot me a message and whatever and fucking catch up and I can loop you in with all the weird shenanigans. <laughs> yeah, really, really long -thon is impressive as it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good night, gamer. Gaming. All right, Fantar. Go back to work so you can afford to rent a hotel for a month. Need anything else? All right. Taking off? Let me. Welcome to the world of shadows, where deal. I mean, like, I know half of it is, like, we're kind of just joking about it, but at the same point, like, this, this is a really pretty game, but I, I, I really, really, really wish, you wish to, you that, wish to that, you know, I had the ability to, like, start moving after I load into the damn game, you know? Are you like there's even like slight lag and frame drop on the menus? <laughs> I mean, like it looks cleaner, but P3R runs incredibly much better. <laughs> like, and that's my big complaint is like anytime you enter in, it just fucking like clunks. I don't even fucking care. Make my own damn demons. <laughs> All right. May as well take this on. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, I know. I love cute Jack Frost. <laughs> Hi, here we go. Welcome back. Well, I mean, it depends how poor those decisions were. Yo, RJ and Bomb Bomb on the double team? Boys! Hello. Speaking of wonderful people that also enjoy RPG Limit Break, y'all don't know RJ. RJ is run incredible games like Suikoden, uh, as well as Omori. It seems you've noticed. Bomb Bomb well. is one of the OGs in the Final Fantasy speedrunning community. Y'all be? were doing Tokyo some fire red leaf green? Vanishing? Damn. Tell me more. The Shikana Shikana glory is unraveling. Tokyo was actually. Were you boys once, causing trouble two tonight? Decades ago. But God copied it back mm. into existence, preventing any further anarchy. Nice. How did it go? That was God's greatest modern miracle. I've never had the balls to do one. The Shekinah glory. However, with God defeated, 
that miracle has begun to dissipate. <laughs> no, thank you. Along with the Kaizo pain. Yeah. I, um, the, the most challenging fast. Pokemon thing Tokyo I've done was, uh, forever. Infinite Fusion. And that was definitely a challenge for my very, very tiny brain. Incoming message Third badge? Japan. Cool. Tomorrow, a Pentagonic <laughs> Summit will be held oh. with all of Bethel's leadership. I don't know. The it is. It's also free. And I would definitely highly recommend it. At the it's, Tokyo Diet Building. it's a very unique take on Pokemon, I think. Not just like, oh, you can mix stuff together, but like the way they rewrite the story, um, how things interact. Like, it's actually really neat. <laughs> yeah, welcome in, friends. I'm Kios. This is SMT5. Uh, at the worst you'll ever see it, considering we're getting like a super cool port of it at some point. Crab Souls Blackout Bingo. I gave up drinking a while ago, but. <laughs> um, unless you're, what, another crab's treasure? Uh. Maybe. Um, if I recall correctly, uh, Chris Rees, one of his friends is actually like the head dev for that game. Well, are you prepared? It's shaping up to be a rather intense meeting, considering that the Japan division intends to break away from Bethel. Every country will be represented at the summit, so this is sure to cause quite a stir among men. No, no, no. Sure I, I've, I've found that I not. went from, like, not really great at Souls-type games to being actually halfway decent. Just remember not to fret. I'm not sure what, no like, what, happens, I shall protect you. what caused that change? After all, we know. will be attending a pandemic maybe. summit. Nigh anything can happen during such an event. Yeah, but like even then, that doesn't guarantee that you get like decently though. good. I merely recognize that you were dragged into this situation and that you deserve a full understanding of it. I wish to see you rise against any obstacle in your path and use the circumstances to your advantage. It will be crucial to your survival. Oh, nice. Love me some stalkers. Hey, get some rest early. All right. Well, let's go to the summit where we're going to tell everyone we're fucking leaving. I'm sure this will be great. Okay. Not weak to hold. Not weak to holy. Not weak to holy. The tricky bit is finding not weak to holy, but having access to dark. <laughs> assume because it's Bethel that probably a fire back somewhere in there too. <laughs> oh, we could run either. Not terrible. Yeah, let's let's go with this. How bad could it be, right? 
I play action games and have the muscle memory for it. Maybe, but like... You're assuming that I'm not an idiot. <laughs> and I'm kind of an idiot. <laughs> I've been real. I'm not gonna lie, I've I've started to really enjoy like the Pardon amount of me. like wild challenges and Kaizos and Iron Mons that are popping up. Like it it makes me feel good that, you know, uh there there are also people that enjoy suffering for a living. <laughs> Third badge with a Rosalia though. That's that's silly. Uh, but yeah, if y'all don't know me, hi, I'm Kios. I speedrun 15 uh, amongst other other RPGs. I do Time challenge runs, I cook, I clean, go, I 3D print. Ah, if it isn't the champion I of the Ario exist. campaign <laughs> But you hopefully you're all having a tremendous night. While we cut scene, I'll give y'all some links. There's the Discord if you want to hang out with us. Um, cooking stream this Saturday if you're subbed. Definitely vote. Don't forget you can use channel points for that stuff too. Because I know fucking cash is always tight. There's the YouTube if you want to catch up on our challenge playthroughs, speedrun tutorials, PBs. Uh, the Moto Vlogs are there, the cooking the streams are there, the unedited sure DJ sets are, are there. Except for that one, because the copyright claimant on that was really odd. I can only um, tell this is going to be a mess. Yeah, well, I think that's that that's it. Uh, Please direct user if you're a tea drinker like me, off. check out the blends we put together with our friends over at Adagio. Proceeds benefiting the Trevor Project. And my wife is a very talented lady. She crochets really adorable creatures, including a ah uh, femet. It's really cute. You should check it out. Uh, she also makes one of a kind, handmade, ethically sourced bone jewelry. So if you or a loved one is a big titty goth girlfriend or boyfriend, that's the shop for you. Last but not least, you want to support the stream a little bit extra? Feel free. Take a look at the throne wish list. Get yourself some extra cooking votes. And, you know, brain chemicals. Yay. I speak for the Greeks. And I, the Nordic branch. I shall be filling in as Lord Shiva's proxy. What, did the Lord of Dance tire himself out? Lord Shiva simply refuses to sit in with the rest of you. <laughs> wow. Now That's let's rude. Begin with this pandemonic nonsense and be done with it. Abdiel? Very well. As many of you are surely aware, we have recently achieved a decisive victory over the legions of chaos. Cert, Ishtar, Ariok. Each of them were formidable in their own right, yet all lie slain at the feet yeah, of Yeah, for real. Japan. Also, why is she flying? Like, bitch, get and down forth, here. All forces that marched into the You're not special. May retreat and return to their normal duties. I am unconcerned with the fate of Lucifer's thralls. What interests me is the Lord of Chaos himself. Word is he took out the creator. Tell me what you make of that. Clearly that falsehood was designed to lead us astray. Do not be deceived. Bethel must remain... Shun the non-believers. If you're old enough to get that reference, uh, don't forget. You should probably get up, stretch, get yourself some water, take some leave so your hips don't hurt tomorrow morning. I see no merit in joining forces any further. Lord Shiver has in fact expected this and is already preparing our next move. Patience, everyone. 
Perhaps it would do so well to leave him cap I mean, yeah, if you need something stronger, by all means. Uh, but if it's not prescribed to you, I definitely don't recommend just blasting pharmaceuticals. Let us each take a moment to reason amongst ourselves. This is a good opportunity to discern where each faction stands. Go and listen to what each of them has to say. Oh yeah, thanks Koshimizu. I'm sure that you're definitely not gonna hang me out to dry here by my fucking short and curlies. See for yourself, the creator's <laughs> almighty handiwork. See how the Earth had we the authority. We would create a world of gladness. The creator's dead. His throne ought to be. Oh, I'm sick of hearing babble from that winged wench and her automatons. Long ago, the creator and his, his boundless, boundless arrogance. Issued an e this condemnation forbade the existence of Nahobino outright, thus preventing any chap. But wait, are you not a Nahobino? Huh. A Interesting. Great undoing is upon us. I must say, this world of flaws and contradictions fashioned by an app. Eighteen years. We were wrong Oop. to place our trust in one God. Only a multitude of divine beings can give the world the proper. Furthermore, it is only right for us, the Amatsukami, to keep our land secure. I've always aspired to keep our city safe. To me, yes, working Luna. with Director Koshimizu seems the most logical way to accomplish that. And now, with everything that's happened, it's clear to me that one almighty being isn't enough to protect Tokyo. That's why I want the world to be as the director in Vish. I'm Japanese. Still. The creator can never be defeated. But were huh. that even to be All right, true, let's spaghetti. Surely he would rise up once more. Yes, we must await his glorious return. Until then, we join hands and guide our. I don't people. trust her that or her thigh gap. Steve. Hear me. Bethel's mission is to sustain this world, God's world. Any objections? Damn right there are. I say you cut the act and admit your god is dead and gone. He speaks true. Besides, Lord Shiva will soon bring this world to its proper end. On whose authority? If any being is to decide this world's fate, it will be me. No, me. Not while the condemnation stands, it won't. It is undeniable proof that the Most High still sits upon the throne. Does he? Then how do you explain the Nahobino <coughs> standing here before Don't, us? don't fucking point the finger at me. I didn't do shit. I've been the one that's killing all the demons. Jesus. Are we to take it this god of yours deems him a worthy successor to the throne? Forgive me, but is he not the proto-fiend of Bethel? Has your god not chosen him? Very well. <coughs> if his existence serves as blasphemy, I cannot remain... Yo, what up, Proxy? Ignorance. We're about to fight big ol' angel Dami Mommy. Hey, high spirits, I have an idea. Why don't we open up a pizza franchise? <clears throat> but the staff is just witness um, as I smite this well proportioned uh, women earth. with bad attitudes. We'll call it Domino's. Hey, nice, off to a good start.
All right, Alice, do your thing. Always two. Motherfucker. Maybe she's not as strong as I thought. Hmm. That's not gonna help. Rude. Stack another Matarinda on that. <laughs> She's demanding, Bubba. Who, Alice? Oh, yeah, she's plus nine. <laughs> That's par partially why I did it. Her magic stat is really good. <clears throat> oh. Oh, thank fuck. Must be immune to a lot of shenanigans. Yeah, just keep dropping that attack. <laughs> Block, resist, survive. Damn. You know what? Let's go. was bogus.
she'll be able to heal off the rest. You know, I'd love to just see four for once, though. Oh. We'll get him on the, uh... Get him back on the pain train. I. Uh, yeah, there we go. Mm, all we got to do is just keep riding this out. Let's see if we can guess what she's got in store. She didn't use that. It's got to be it's got to be fire. Got to be. I think you're so much better than a demon. Better fucking hope it is. Yes. Rest in piss, bozo. Let's risk it. In before this hangs me by the fucking dick. No. <clears throat> we'll be all right. It's gonna be a close one. Wither. Just in case, cover our ass. Thank you so much. <coughs> I think Alice gets the kill here, though. <coughs> That's my girl. Hell yeah.
Impossible. How could I have fallen? So this is the power meant for us. Not bad now, Bino. God was right to be afraid. Perhaps I, too, will seek out my old knowledge. And so were our ties to Bethel severed. When we next meet, it shall be as adversaries. May none be so foolish as to cross me. I must inform Lord Shiver of this new development. Well, I'm done. Oh no, we've broken up the alliance! Ah. They all have forsaken us for their own selfish gain. Does this please you, Sukuyomi? To see demon kind fall to chaos? To see all that Bethel Earth. has struggled for scattered? I truly couldn't be more satisfied. Uh Entrusting this beautiful world to such a vain despot was always a mistake. We shall establish a new world order. One where countless gods oh, can freely find <laughs> As for you, Abdiel, may you find your home. Just flashes us out of existence. <sighs> By the way, Muy interesante. Oh, may as well pop a save on this one. Sleepest doodless. This man always be busting me about Maka, bro. Need anything else? Yeah, you'd get off my dick. Goofy ass looking skeleton. That might be something very useful. Oh, whole bunch of other ones here. Oh, that would recycle Lamu though. Oh. Interesting. <laughs> no electric. Pretty interesting. It'd definitely be something to look at.
There's definitely gonna, definitely gonna be a lot of things to kind of poke around with. Speaking of which. Oh, hey, it's the boys. Yeah, I will go over as I stated earlier. The Japanese branch will become its own entity, separate from Bethel. And in order to save Tokyo, I'm honestly not sure, Minx. God's throne. If there's anything you aren't clear on, now would be the time to ask. God is dead. Long live the gods. The throne, or perhaps creation itself. I will explain in full detail. What is a Nahobino? The throne of creation exists to prove one's dominion over the earth. <laughs> Whoever assumes the throne may determine the world's laws and in a way. How like do how the you have established more his own order? Fucked up her. Woman, I brushed the shit out of you today. Before the creator, many other gods fought viciously over the throne yeah, and has the right to rule the world. Okay, it's been a while. Yeah, yeah, about like another 20 in minutes. Order to save Definitely made a large chunk of progress in this game, though. Uh, Regarding the war of the gods, the Imperial how much I got left in this, perhaps high spirits? Itself. I will explain in full detail. What is a twenty? I figured as much. I feel like it's roughly the halfway-ish point. But if it's anything like the other SMT games, like the last couple of dungeons just kind of fucking exist forever. Yeah, exactly. That's what I was gonna figure. And diabolized us all. Good old obelisk. He accomplished this by spiriting our knowledge away. Without the knowledge needed to shape a functioning world, we ceased to be divine and were left to contend <sighs> with our fallen nature. Our knowledge was sealed within the Garden of Eden. Mortals soon ate of its fruit, binding all knowledge to their souls and all who came after. Ever since the fall of man, demons have vied to steal the souls of humankind and restore their former selves, but they were doomed to fail. Long it was futile to seek out our knowledge and reclaim our former glory, but with Armageddon fulfilled, the rules have yet again changed. <clears throat> Regarding the war of the gods, the Empyrean, the throne. Ever since oh, I have to mind, answer the all these. Do battle for the right. Before the creator reigned supreme, the throne belonged to Baal, god of the harvest. And even before that, it was held by Ra, the sun god. Every god who assumes the throne obtains its vast power. Enough as such, many a god has fallen in pursuit of that power. Regarding okay. the war of the gods, the, the throne of creation lies at the pinnacle. Yo, what up, Bear? What's up, man? Ah, shit. Is it, did, I get the, I, did I miss the memo everyone has to raid me tonight or something? How was your stream, brother? That what are you working on? That is would be now, were he not ousted by Lucifer, as was claimed. Considering our fusion into a Nahobino, the claim is likely valid. Only Nahobino are allowed in the Empyrean's sacred space. As such, Curl and Twerdus as I live in. Thus far. Uh, We're doing okay. Not but a bad you, night. However, can. Do Ooh, Dark Pictures Anthology. Anthology. That's a good choice. I intend to become a Nahobino as well. Algami's true name is Susano. -o. As Susano. -o. Food, he was created to inherit the Amatsukami's full power. I myself provided the template. Nice. That is such a good choice. And as I've said before, I am Sukoyomi of the Amatsukami. 
It is my personal mission to become an So at what point do I have to kill this dude because he decides to lose his mind and become an absurdly power hungry? Listen, ain't no man with eyebrows like that not so evilly shit. The one to create the world, being that only the Nahobino can do it. It could very well end up being him. But what if I were to say that you, Yuzuru Atsuta, also have that potential? Yeah, we uh, we cleared up a, a bunch of side quests and probably a big boss After, fight. What? Yes, if you so choose, um, you too We got through the, the new the Final Fantasy VII Rebirth demo, which was pretty heckin' fun, Will pretty neato. So in service of your home? Uh... And yeah, fifteen didn't really want to cooperate tonight, be, but we tried our best. The same as him. If I really do have that power, enough to see. Hmm. Your resolve is admirable. Excellent. We now have two Nahobino on our side, Atsuta and you. From here, we strike at Bethel headquarters, then make our way to the Imperium post haste. Hey, uh, guys, you think? I no, Ichiro, you're a you. loser. My condolences, Dazai, but you do not appear to bear the knowledge of Anamatsuka. Yeah, pretty solid stream. Oh. Don't. That's why you wear a hat that says I "sucker" on it. Another's knowledge resting within you. No way. However, only its owner can identify it. So I suggest you stay on guard. A demon may be lying in wait for you. With that said, I must begin investigating a way to reach the Imperium. I'm fairly certain the secret lies in Ueno, given the density of Bethel's security there. So, I will concentrate our branch's efforts on that. I, listen, I wanted I to poke around with it, and I'm really answer. not disappointed. Then, I'm hoping there's a little me. bit more polish on performance mode when it drops, but otherwise, I really don't have too many complaints. Besides, like, the fact that I'm rusty as shit <laughs> with the combat in that game. Hey, what do you think I should do now? I can't decide anything on my own. I don't know. Be a fucking astronaut, kid. I guess I really do need Master Abdiel. Uh, say, uh, do you know where she is? Oh, all right. No, I, you know what? Whatever. Get yourself killed. Homie walking like he shit his pants. Master Abdiel, are you all right? I lost to the Japanese branch. It no longer matters what happens to me. I mean, you could join us. But that's not true. You're not done yet, Master Abdiel. You saw what happened. Even an archangel is no match for a Nahobino. Then maybe you just have to become a Nahobino too. I'll find the human who has your knowledge, and I'll bring them to you. That won't be necessary. Uh oh. I... They're already here. Huh? It is you, Ichiro Dazai. You are my knowledge. Me? I'm your knowledge? Yeah, now she's gonna ask you to lick her boots clean. You're probably gonna do it. <laughs> Wait, that means you can use me to become a Nahobino! The power of the Nahobino is forbidden. <clears throat> As the Archangel, I must not defy the condemnation. But if you became a Nahobino, then you could... Anyway, I'm leaving now. 
My man's hair is so on point. Lucifer, what's up? Anyway, not my problem. Hey. Can you hear me? Oh. Thank goodness. Listen, we need to talk. It's serious, but I can't really tell you here. Would you mind meeting me on the roof? Hey, yo, is it always wear gloves, muffler, glasses, girl? I don't remember her name, but she was cute. Can you meet me on the roof? Oh, hey. She's not dead. Sorry, I just showed up out of nowhere. That's 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 good. Yes, but not in the way you might think. Are you a ghost? The Tao Isonokami you knew did die. But her soul was reborn by a power beyond description, forming who I am now. Okay. As the goddess Cute jacket. of creation, my new purpose is to guide the Nahobino to his throne. Oh, that's a cool design. Take a good look. Tokyo is fading like the setting sun. Its time is almost up. Before it's too late, I want you to reach the Empyrean and recreate the world. You risked your life for me and Sahori without even a moment's hesitation. To us, you're a true savior, and in every sense of the word. What power I have shall be yours. And together, we can forge a new future. Can we, though? Until then, will you let me fight at your side? That's all I ask of you. I'm sure. Then let us go forward together. We both know God's miracle is dissipating. Listen, you better have some cool skills or I'm going to be mad. And everyone in it will vanish without a trace. If this stirs your heart even a little, make for the throne and create a new world, one according to your vision. And to foster that, I'll escort you to Dot, where the path to the Empyrean lies.
Bye, Luna. A new realm of Dot lies before us. One that leads to the Empyrean. Oh. The path to the Empyrean. It has also been called the Temple of Eternity. Oh boy. Like I'm going to spend an eternity Long in this the first area. Being, Fabulous. The entity who oversaw this world created a bridge to the throne. However, Bethel headquarters has hidden the keys to access it, and so the path remains closed. There are three keys in total. It used to be that Bethel guarded them for safekeeping. But now, the branches that possess them think only of their own gain. So the first thing we need to do is get those keys ourselves. Perhaps a protofiend could detect the energy of divine instruments such as these. I am indeed picking up sources of incredible power. Three in total. I say we'd better hurry. I'm sure you can guess how many Nahobino aspirants are after the key. <sighs> I'm hyped. The music for this has been really good the entire game. That design's really freaking neat, too. Hmm. Hey, it's you! <laughs> well, what are the odds? Seriously. Why are you still here? Zaka, what the hell are you on about? Anyways, count me in. Someone's got to keep you out of trouble. All right. <laughs> totally. Mm, the more the merrier, I guess. Mm. I assume Tao doesn't actually do anything besides just like heal us after battle, like the other Tao. See what she does. Mm, bad, so it's like a version of Golden Apple. That's it's pretty slick. Yeah, basically, it's just hyped up Eden with uh, a little bit better affinities. Well, affinities and resistance. That's not it's not bad. I'll tell you what. <clears throat> She's a little sixty though. Which lets me know I'm a bit behind the eight ball. Well, I don't really know the makeup of the area yet, so. Oh, I can imagine. All right, I don't have to register. Cool. Oh. All right, we got like four or five minutes. Let's poke around a little bit and call it a night. I'd like to ask you something. As a Nahobino, we can reach the Empyrean. Doing so will allow you to orchestrate the laws of... So, should we reach the... I see. 
I can only admit this is rather strange, though. It's not the same as the responsibilities that have bit on us. Blah, blah, blah. So just, just shut up. Ah. I fought a bunch of those dudes before. That was not an easy fight. I know I've fought Decorabia before. Yeah, I saw a few of them floating around over here, so like I'm not super concerned about them. Well, soda. Nice. Really the only place to put those besides you. Know? <laughs> Interesting. I've definitely fought both of these before, but okay. Here. Resist physical. Weak wind. Anyway, oh, that's just fucking oodles of noodles of HP there. Oh, all right, well, let's put you down. Yeah, that's some chonky experience. Cool. All right, well, I'm sure we'll have to grind a bit. There. Let's take a bath. Well, yeah, it is that time of the night for me. I got to call it a night. Um, tomorrow will be a shorter stream, as per usual. Oh, yeah, I can only imagine. Oh, look. That's probably Horus right there. But, as per usual, we'll give you all the rundown before we go to bed. There is the Discord. Feel free to join us there. Uh, get your cooking boats in. And, you know, hang out. Play video games with us. It's a very comfy place to be. There is the YouTube if you want to catch up on what you've potentially missed. Um... I try and keep that as up-to-date as I possibly can. Uh, yeah, toss this subscription there. Definitely check it out. Tea drinkers, check out the blends we put together with our friends over at Daggio. Proceeds benefiting Trevor Project. Check out my wife's super cool Etsy. You can get yourself some really cute crochets. You can get yourself some really cute bone jewelry or 3D printed accessories. You support a small business. Last but not least, you want to support the stream, get yourself some extra cooking boats. Um, you know, provide brain chemicals to the cat boy. Feel free to check out the throne wish list. But for me, I'm going to call it here tomorrow. <clears throat> we will be back 
We're 15, and I, I don't even know what I have on the schedule. Maybe we'll sneak some frosting, because that's a quick one. But either way, I appreciate you all hanging out with us tonight. We'll see you tomorrow. Good job, everybody.